Again, a quick question, Dr. Rutledge. Uh, every day we come across patients here who ask me, why don't you use robot for doing mini gastric bypass? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, what's your opinion about robotic surgery and mini gastric bypass? Well, I have a little beard, mm -hmm. a little small beard, a few mm -hmm. hairs here. I don't use a robot to trim my hair. So I think that the robot makes sense. There are uh, deep areas in the pelvis, mm -hmm. uh, prostate, uh, low rectal anastomoses, things like that where the robot will make a difference. And maybe in the future, we will all become robots or we'll all use robots, even robots to open the doors for us and things like that. But a robot is more expensive. It takes mm -hmm. a, You can't have a robot for free. If you use a robot to do mm -hmm. something simple, like for example, you know, I could cut my fingernails with a robot. Mm -hmm. I don't do that because that would be expensive to buy a robot. Yeah. So if MGB was a very complicated operation, uh, an MGB can be done badly, as we've talked about, if you don't understand it. Mm -hmm. But the surgical technique of doing the uh, MGB is very simple. It's right in front of you. It's why it's so safe. Mm -hmm. It's why it's so easy to revise. If you're using a robot to do the MGB, it's because you have to pay off the robot and you want to charge the patient. The robot has a place, mm -hmm. and maybe in the future it becomes cheaper and it becomes something yeah. the hospital has purchased, but it makes no sense for an MGB. As of today, it doesn't make any sense. No, you're just, mm -hmm. and in fact, you're just, you may not tell the patient this, but you're charging them for the robot because yeah. I don't know if you know this, but the robots are expensive, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we have made a robotic operation theater, but when I look at uh, the robots available today, mm -hmm. Uh, I don't feel like putting my patient under these robots because it looks like they're huge ones, crude. Yeah, I, I, Maybe in future you, we if, get if some, you need, something better. If, yes, yeah. if you need it. If, if you have to operate deep in the pelvis of somebody mm -hmm. who's obese, and uh, the, the MGB, the beauty of it, is the reason it's so easily done and so quick is because everything's in yeah. front of you. Yeah, the time to you take to set up the robot and no, no. you to dock everything in no, that no. in that time you can and finish the MGB. No, actually, no. Yeah. that's that's mm -hmm. you no, know, no, that's just uh, that's. I'm sure there's good robot doctors and they do a lot of yeah. robots and I'm not opposed to robots, but that they don't do robots to trim their beard. Yeah. So it depends what kind of procedure you're doing. If there's it's a, a complicated place, There's a procedure. place for the robot if you have to go around a corner yeah. and down into the heart or something like that. But right. for an MGB, I don't use a robot to, to, yeah. to cut my hair on my chin. <laughs> That's right. Thank you. Yeah.